Abby found one? Yeah. Yes! Hey guys, yeah. let's walk down this creek bottom and, and check all these trees. The elm tree feels like styrofoam. Have you found one? Yeah. Yes. Okay, everyone. Oh, well, you picked it already? Uh, yep. Okay. Let me see it. Oh, nice. Let's... Levi, be careful where you're walking. Yeah, everyone slow down. Oh, yeah, Abby. My it's, eyes. It's even getting a little bit brown, so you know nice. it's a little bit old. All right. So everybody keep walking. So this is... If you know there's one in the area, there could be more. So everyone slow down and look around. And also take a chance, just take some time and look around and see what trees are around. And then, well, you don't necessarily have, you don't necessarily need to know what kind of tree it is. But if you know what it looks like, Ooh, nice snail. So that means guys, you need to get down low. Levi, especially when we get into a place where we found one, make sure you look at the ground before you take every step. Okay? And that's how you mushroom her. I found one, I found one. Jacob, hold on, let's see it. Ooh, you found a baby one. Yeah, that was a tiny one, but I would have just left it, but it looked damaged.
What'd you find? These big orange mushrooms on the ground. Huh. Cool. I just call those LBMs. Little brown mushrooms. <laughs> <laughs> You didn't find any more? Nope. Are you looking? Yep. Well, a lot of leg work. Mushroom hunting with kids is pretty funny. They're always yelling, I found something, I found something. Like, a morel? No. What is it? It's a tree. Oh, good job, you found a tree. I mean, there's trees everywhere. <laughs> I found a small mushroom. Oh, a small morel? Yeah, the small morel. You got magnifying glasses in those in those glasses? Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's good. Got anything else to say for the camera? No. Nope. Are you sure? No. Nope. Just uh, sitting down editing the video from today and I realized our microphone jack wasn't plugged in all the way so we lost a lot of the footage. I started mushroom hunting about five years ago and I remember specifically uh, thinking wow this is a lot of work uh, it's hard to find these things you got to look so hard that your eyes start bugging out of your head and it reminded me then and I was reminded of it today that there's a scripture that says you will find me when you search for me like silver and gold And I just kind of, I just wonder what this world would be like if we actually search for God, like the way I search for morel mushrooms. I just want to thank everyone for checking out the Kill Me Live video today. Don't forget to like us and subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one. I mean, Kill Me out. <laughs>